Hello and welcome to GMAX Studios. Today we are going to talk about firmware upgrades. Now firmware upgrades are software patches that are released by the camera manufacturer after the camera has been released in the market. This usually addresses bugs and issues that might have come to the camera the manufacturer's notice uh, after the camera has been released and uh, it also makes the camera more compatible with newer accessories or newer lenses that might have hit the market after the camera. So it is very important to have the latest firmware upgrade on your camera. This video is specifically for upgrading the firmware for Canon cameras. If you have got any other brand of camera like say a Nikon or a Sony or a Fuji, please look in the description below and you will find the link to those videos there. As with all cameras, make sure that your battery is 100% charged before starting the firmware upgrade. We are going to use a Canon 7D for this video. So we first put a memory card inside the camera and format it. Remember, it is very important to format the memory card in the camera and not on the computer. And formatting will erase all data from the card. Once the format is complete, we connect the memory card to the computer. Next, we go to the Canon website to download our firmware. You can either use the Canon Europe website which is canon-europe.com or the Canon USA website which is at usa.canon.com. Both the links are given in the description below. We are going to use the Canon Europe website to download our firmware. So we go to the support section and select consumer products and we will see a list of products from where we choose EOS cameras. You will see a complete list of all EOS cameras. Since we are using a 7D, we select that model. It takes us to the available drivers and you can see that it has selected my operating system automatically. We can see two firmwares available, the Windows and the Mac version. We click on more details if we want to see what all does this firmware have to offer. And then we download it. We see a disclaimer which says that Canon is not responsible for any damage that might happen to the camera because of this firmware upgrade. Very nice. So once the firmware has downloaded, we click on it and we see a .fir file. We copy this file and paste it into the formatted memory card in the root. It should not be in any other folder. It should be in the root of the card. We then eject the card from the computer and put it back in the camera again. Now when we go to the version we will see that it asks us whether we want to update the firmware or not. Now my firmware is up to date but I am still going to update it to show you. So we see the firmware update program loading and once it loads it will show you the firmware version once again and It'll ask you whether you want to upgrade from firmware version so and so to so and so. You press OK and the update begins. 
Now this can take a pretty long time depending upon your camera and the memory card that you're using. So I'm going to fast forward to the section where it's almost done. And the firmware update is complete. You might need to reset the time and date on the camera after the update has finished. So that is it for now. Uh, do share this video with your friends and for more photography tips like this, please do subscribe to our channel. Until the next time, bye-bye.